Welcome back to TaxPress. Today, I will be showing you how to transfer your money directly from your WISE account and send it all of this directly inside Payoneer. So welcome guys to TaxPress. While this is an easier and direct way to transfer funds between these two platforms, let's see the process of moving your money from WISE directly into your banking account and then directly into Payoneer. So this uh, method, this multi-platform method is going to be really easy. First of all, what I need to do is to go into my WISE account and log it in. I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description so you can all get started with the actual great deal totally for free. Once you've logged it in, you want to transfer your money from WISE to your banking account. To adding a banking account, you need to add this in a transaction receipt. So let's focus here on the part that says receipts. And here I go for add recipient. Here you choose the currency that your banking account accepts. So for example, let's go for United States dollar. And here I choose uh, enter the bank details. Now, in this case, the recipient is ourself, and I added the ACH routing number, the account number, and if this is a checkings or a saving card. Once you have successfully done this, this should be now added and appearing into your actual recipient code. So, what I need to do now is to locate the currency that I wanted to send. Let's go here into the United States, U dollar, I go for a send. And here, what you can do is to make sure that you have just have balance in order to make this statement. So it's going to be a really easy process. Just select the element that we have to send it, and of course, to send away, and choose the recipient in order to continue. In this case, I choose the recipient, and in this case, should be ourselves, the actual account we have just added a few seconds ago. And lastly, here's the confirmation. So make sure that everything looks correctly and go for confirmed and send. Your money should be now available directly into your banking account. Now that you have your money directly into your banking account, what we can do is to go back here into Payoneer and create an actual account. So I'm going to sign into my Payoneer account. I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description once again, just in case you don't have. And now that you signed in, what I wanted to do is to get started in linking an actual banking account into the Payoneer, if not already linked it. So if you haven't linked your banking account to Payoneer yet, you need to do this first. So in your Payoneer account, you want to focus inside your settings. So let's focus here into the right part of my account and go for settings. And here, what you can do is to locate your banking account and make the actual verification. If you don't see this, you can focus directly into the lab pod and you can find now the banking accounts here into the lab pod. So both sections should be appearing now there. Now here, what you want to do is to add a banking account or to choose bank account for uh, receipt. In this case, receive account. So as you can see, we don't have approved accounts. What you can do is to request a new one. Whether you wanted to use this money for payment inside Payoneer or just to get paid. So if I want to choose the option that says pay, I have here the batch payment. So pay to the recipient bank account. So I match manage my recipient banking accounts. So I go here for add bank account. So what you can do is to add all your basic information. Where is the country you're currently living? What is the banking account currency that you have? The recipient details, the answer the account, the account details, and can fill the pay on the account details. And after that, you hit now into adding your banking account. Your banking account should now be appearing in here. And then what you can do is now to use your Payoneer account to make payments. When you actually want to make a payment, it's going to be asking you how would you like to get started. And you choose to get to pay, of course, with your actual new banking account that you can just added in here. And it's a very easy process and everything should not be set up automatically. Now, in this case, since this is an actual test account, we are not able to add a banking account, but the process actually is exactly the same as we actually just showed you. And that, guys, is how you can transfer your money from WISE into your banking account and send it directly into Payoneer so you can use this as a bridge for making payments directly inside Payoneer and you don't have to use WISE anymore. So it's going to be a really easy process, guys, if you want to use Payoneer for your future future payments to providers then go directly into get pay and pay so you can add the same banking account and you don't have to use wise anymore so guys if you find this tutorial helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more great tools of pioneer wise and for your banking account thank you guys so much for watching the video hopefully we can see you next time